Hi everyone. Um, you might recognize me as Origami Champion in 2010 to 2015, and then I disappeared from the scene. Um, I've not touched paper for about four months now, but I never lost my passion. So now I'm very excited to tell you about my newest venture, um, Origami. Origami is like origami, but with air. It's way more advanced, but inspiring and so rewarding. I used to fold paper just like everybody else. You know the story. Young, budding, 13-year-old battling her way through the cruelty of puberty discovers a passion for Japanese paper art. We've all been there. And like you, I started with the basics. You know? Swans, stars, boats, hats, which are basically the same, it just it depends where you put them. I dedicated my entire being to the craft. It wasn't long before I could make the Taj Mahal out of cardboard. You know, it's fold or be folded with cardboard. Boy, did I fold it. I could create anything out of everything in my sleep. Literally folding paper in my sleep. I once broke up with an origami diorama of scarf dangling me fast off a cliff in my bed. Spoiler, my facet dies. One day I was folding John Hamm out of his rice paper and I just thought to myself like, you can be better. You know, you're great, but you can be better. And I looked up around me and there it was. Why fold paper when I can fold air? It's a whole new branch of air art. Air art. You can make it with all sorts of air. Oxygen, carbon dioxide, methane. Get this. It's free. And you never get paper cuts. I'm really excited for this year and I, I really think that origami is just going to take off. In the meantime, this is for you.